Hello students, welcome to the channel Top Gate. In this video, I'll discuss one more very interesting problem of DFA that is to design a DFA that accepts all binary strings which are divisible by 3. So this question is very often asked in university exams as well as it is very often asked in uh, uh, competitive exams also. Okay, uh, It is a very easy question but it is just uh, looking like very complex, but it is a very easy question. Okay, so let's first understand what kind of language we have in this one and then what kind of uh, shortest possible strings we can have in this one. So it is saying that we have to design a DFA that accepts all binary strings over the alphabet 0, 1. So of course, since we are using 0, 1, so all the strings will be in the form of binary only. And it is saying that we need to accept only those strings which are divisible by 3. That is, when we divide that number with 3, we should get the remainder as 0. Okay. So now, uh, first of all, let's understand what kind of binary system do we have and what are the decimal numbers. So in binary, suppose we have the first one as 0, 0, 0. Okay. And it is the binary. Okay. And this is the decimal. So in binary, we have 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1. So in decimal, it is 0. It is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So this is the binary and decimal. And when we divide these numbers with 3, what is the remainder that we will get? So I will write the remainder here. That is, if I divide this number that is 0 by 3, we will get 0 remainder. In this one, I will get 1 remainder, then 2 remainder, then 0, then 1, then 2, again 0, uh, then 1, then 2, then again 0, 1, 2, 0, 1, 2 and so on. Okay, So uh, it is saying that we should accept only those numbers in which the remainder is 0. So I should accept this 0, 0, 0. I should accept this one. I should accept this one. I should accept this one and so on. So 0, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, all these numbers should be accepted. Okay, so what I'll do, uh, the logic in this one is, in this one I'll take three states. One state will be the state on which the remainder is 0, one state is the state on which the remainder is 1 and one state is a state on which the remainder is 2. So let's take the state as Q0 and on this Q0 the remainder is 0. Then there is Q1 on this state the remainder is 1 and at Q2 on this state the remainder is 2. That is, whenever we are getting a number that is in which the, uh, after dividing the remainder is 0, I will come to this one, okay, and therefore I will make it as final, since we need to accept only those numbers which are divisible by 3 where the remainder is 0, since we have taken this Q0 for only those numbers where the remainder is getting as 0 only, and at Q1, I will be coming with only those numbers in which the remainder is only 1. So this should not be accepted. Therefore, I am not taking Q1 as the final. And on Q2, I will only come when the remainder is a 2. And it is saying it should not accept this one. Therefore, I am not making this also as the final. Okay. So let's start. So first one, it is saying that we have 0. 0 is divisible by 3. Why? If we divide 0 by 3, we will get remainder as 0 only. Therefore, what I will do? I will add simply a self loop of 0 here. That means 0, 0, 0 is getting accepted in this one. So first condition is met now. Now second condition is 0, 0, 1. Now on 0, 0, 1, the remainder is 1. Okay, And we have said that whenever the remainder is 1, I should come to this state. So what I will do? 0, 0, 1. So 0, 0 and 1. So the string is 0, 0, 1. That is 0, 0, 1 is 1 and the remainder is 1. Therefore, with remainder 1, I am coming on state Q1. This condition is also satisfied and we are not accepting it. Correct? Now, third thing is we have 0, 1, 0. So it is saying when 0, 1, 0 is there, that means it is 2. And when 2 is divided by 3, we get a remainder as 2. And I said that whenever the remainder is 2, I should come on to state Q2. So it is saying 0, 1, 0. So 0, 1 and 0. So with 0, I am coming on to state Q2. So this condition is again met. Next number is 0, 1, 1. 0, 1, 1 means 3. And when 3 is divided, the remainder that we get is 0. So 
whenever 0 1 1 is there i should always come to state q not that is the final state so let's see 0 1 and 1 that is this is a three number and with three i am coming on to state q not so this condition is also met so now q1 is complete we have two paths that is one for zero one for one now come to q2 if we want two paths one for zero one for one so one zero zero what i am getting here one zero zero we are getting a four the four is the remainder is one in this case so on remainder one where i should go i should come on to state q1 because q1 is made for the remainder one only so one zero so where to go simply come to this state with zero so one zero and zero so this condition is also met correct now the next one is one zero one so one zero one it is saying it is a five in decimal and with five what i should get i should get a remainder two so one zero one i should land here only that is the remainder should be two so one zero now what to do simply take a loop of one so 1 0 1 that is 5 and we are on to state q2 where the remainder is 2 now let's take any string and check are we landing correctly or not let's take this one 1 0 1 0 so 1 0 1 0 is 10 okay and 10 the remainder should be 1 so for remainder 1 i should come to this q1 so let's check this out 1 0 1 0 so 1 0 1 0 so we are coming on to state q1 that is a correct one now let's take something else take this uh, 14 this time okay so 14 is triple one zero and the remainder should be two so for remainder two i should come on to state q2 okay so we have triple one zero so one 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 zero so we are coming on to state q2 triple one zero and the remainder is two in this case now let's take something else like take this one one zero zero one so one zero zero one is nine and at nine the remainder is zero so where should i go i should come on to state q not only let's check this out so we have one zero zero one one zero zero one so we are coming on to state q not therefore this is a dfa that accepts only those strings which when divided by 3 gives the output 0. Thank you so much.